Right, so coming inside the car, I actually have a new steering wheel, which I've showed you guys. And I'm gonna take off the standard Momo steering wheel to asphyx the new one with the Nardi horn. Right, so, horn, disconnect. It lets me, there we go. I can sit down there. Now I may actually use that for this part. See if it fits in. It doesn't fit, cool, right. <laughs> we shall asphyx. Oh, it's gonna rattle around. No, it's not. Oh, no. Affix. Right. Hey? Affix. A, a fix. Affix. Asphyx. No, not asphyx. Affix. It's gonna asphyx to itself. <laughs> cool, the horn still works. Right, let's see if I can position this like that and sandwich it. Cool, so that doesn't work. <laughs> the metal is actually touching that. That's really annoying. I might have to space it out, I reckon. That's the one that's... That's a story in my life. Just drilling it. Just drilling it. Cool. Now I need to make sure it still works. Dropped it. <laughs> still works. It's not perfect. The trouble is it won't push over now. Same thing. Right, so I've tried to centre the actual Nardi horn in the centre of the steering wheel. Obviously, as I've said already, this isn't a Nardi steering wheel. So the parts that I've actually got, like this and this, don't actually fit the steering wheel. So I've had to sort of sandwich it together with, um, you know, the actual boss of the car and the steering wheel and sandwich the horn, but it still works. That's the main thing. Hopefully when I go around a corner driving, it doesn't actually start the horn in, you know, actually earthing out onto the car and start, you know, the horn actually um, going off for no apparent reason. We can only find out once we actually start driving it. It shouldn't do it because it's actually really far away from the metal of the car, but fingers crossed we are good for it actually working. I'm so much happy with that though. It's such a nice, better look for the car and the contrast from the Japstyle.org neochrome bolts on the actual chrome aluminium effect of the steering wheel and then obviously the wood. I like, I like the style, I like the style, it looks cool. Awesome, there we go, all nice and tight, all happy, looking good. I also have a cup holder that I bought off eBay, genuine from an import Miata. Says some import things in the center there. You literally fit it like that. It is that easy. Now the fake Nardi or, or whatever it is, leave a comment below if you know what steering wheel this is actually from, what car it's from, but Obviously with the price of Nardi's these days, I wanted to get something that was the same sort of style, but not really a replica. I think this is from an older car, but it still gives the same aesthetic looks of a Nardi steering wheel without the hefty price tag. I'm trying to keep this car as a budget build, so very happy with that. Also, the cup holders had to be done with the amount of uh, <coughs> energy drinks that I drink. That had to be done, so that was a tenner off eBay for that little mod. Very, very happy with that and very easy to fit as well. If you've got one and you want to put one in, they literally just clip in.